Hey everyone, I'm Asher Friedberg with the Illuminati, and today we will be discussing the potential of the Midnight Suns appearing in the Marvel Cinematic Universe. Before we begin, be sure to leave a like, subscribe, and share to help us continue to grow. In the comics, the Midnight Suns is a superhero team consisting of more supernatural characters, but not exclusively. Most iterations of this team consist of a combination of supernatural and street-level characters. The MCU currently consists, or will soon consist, of many members of this team, and I think it's very possible, if not inevitable, that we will see this team brought into the Marvel Cinematic Universe. As we continue on into Phase 4 of the MCU, more and more supernatural characters have joined the fray and are set to receive their own projects. Not to mention, a video game featuring a version of the Midnight Suns is set to release this year. With all of this happening at Marvel, no doubt they have discussed a cinematic appearance for the team. With all these announcements alluding to a Midnight Suns project, let's talk about who our MCU Midnight Suns could be. First, who I expect to lead this team of Midnight Suns, Doctor Strange. Doctor Strange has proven himself capable of leadership roles, given he has both taken over for the Sorcerer Supreme, as well as his role in both Avengers Infinity War and Avengers Endgame. Doctor Strange has also shown himself to not be afraid to work with street-level characters, as he assisted Peter Parker in Spider-Man No Way Home. Doctor Strange will next find himself involved with a multiverse of madness in his next solo film, and he will be joined by another potential member of the Midnight Suns, the Scarlet Witch. While not a member of the Midnight Suns in the comics, with Wanda's ties to the supernatural and her upcoming team-up or conflict with Doctor Strange, the Scarlet Witch would make a great addition to the MCU's Midnight Suns. Seeing her read from the Darkhold in the post credit scene for WandaVision proved her qualifications for the team. If Wanda does go on a darker path in Multiverse of Madness, she might need a redemption arc, maybe in the form of joining the Midnight Suns. There's another member of the Midnight Suns coming to the MCU in Phase 4, and that's Moon Knight. As you likely know, Oscar Isaac is set to star as Moon Knight in the self-titled series. In the comics, Moon Knight is a staple member of the Midnight Suns, acting as a bridge between the supernatural characters of the team and the street-level characters. Moon Knight, believing himself to be possessed by the spirit of Khonshu, fights crime as one of his various personalities that inhabit his mind. This character's introduction is another huge hint at the introduction of the Midnight Suns. As most of you know, Blade is heading to the MCU, being played by Mahershala Ali. While this film is on the way, we don't actually have a release date for it, and it could theoretically be a Phase 5 project. Luckily for us, Blade has actually already debuted in the Marvel Cinematic Universe in a post credit scene in Eternals, featuring a voice cameo as he speaks to Dane Whitman. Blade, leaning more supernatural than street level, is the Daywalker, and a hunter of vampires. This character is also a staple member of the Midnight Suns, and I imagine would be featured on the MCU's version of the team. Dane Whitman might join the team as well, due to his comic connections to the supernatural, and his imminent alliance with Blade. This fall, a Werewolf by Night special is rumored to hit Disney+, starring Gael Garcia Bernal. This supernatural werewolf character is expected to debut in the Moon Knight series before his solo special. Yet another staple member of the Midnight Suns is, of course, Ghost Rider. Ghost Rider, Johnny Blaze, has yet to be introduced in the main MCU, but the Robbie Reyes version of the character did make appearances in the Agents of S.H.I.E.L.D. series. It's been heavily rumored that Norman Reedus will be playing the version of the character in an upcoming project, and the actors played very coy about it on social media. The final character I'm going to discuss for the MCU's potential Midnight Suns will be Morbius. This one is a little tricky, as we don't know if Morbius is in the MCU or not. We did see him interact with Vulture in the trailer for his solo film, but we really don't know what is going on yet. We do know that as of now, Disney and Sony are playing nice, so hopefully that means that Morbius could cross over from the Sony universe to the main MCU. If that's the case, we would have an amazingly stacked and comic accurate team of Midnight Suns. That's just about all the characters I think are a real possibility to be in the MCU's Midnight Suns. There's plenty more characters that could be introduced, but given what we have now, this is our predicted roster. Tell us in the comments, what would your Midnight Suns team look like? Thank you all for watching, don't forget to leave a like, subscribe, and share, and be sure to check us out on all of our social media sites, as well as checking out my other content on the channel. See y'all next time!